Et voilà, aujourd'hui, on a frôlé Donc, les 140. Donc, le sur les céréales, il a augmenté plus que 70 C'est un timing, là, au niveau planétaire, qu'est-ce qui se passe présentement. Et puis ces crises-là, mises ensemble, remettent en question le système dans lequel on évolue depuis plusieurs années. Jongler, la broue dans le toupette, pousser notre brouette au grand diable des vents, change le monde. What we need from Mikhail is to get the whole of this planet to mobilize the energies of everyone to take it in the right direction. I personally think that as a civilization, we're sleepwalking into the future. So my dream was to have scientists engaging in a consensus report on what sustainability actually is, how it can be defined, and try to make smarter decisions. A lot of changes in the way we do things, but it could be done. The question is, do we want to do it? The secret was to realize that money is not what the economists tell us it is. It's become like an addiction. Most of the powers that be don't really want to get rid of poverty. We want honesty. We want justice. If you're going to shed blood because of our land, we will. We live in a finite planet with the finite resources and with a huge population that is going to compete for these resources. So what makes you optimistic for the future? I'm optimistic because it's possible to reduce our negative impact on the planet by 90%. C'est que partout sur la planète, il y a des petits groupes de citoyens qui qui font des luttes super importantes, c'est tout ce monde là ensemble qui vont faire une différence dans l'avenir. So we need to change our mindset. The fact of the matter is that we all have to do something because we're all in this thing.